Hi, and welcome to our Running Your Day with Timely course. We're super excited to have you on board and we can't wait to help you get Timely's money-making, time-saving, client-loving, business-boosting features working just for you. If you're watching this, then you're probably hopefully all set up with Timely and now it's time for the exciting part, using Timely's clever features to help you run your day in the salon. We'll move through different areas of the system based on a relatively logical order of when you might access each area. We'll start with opening the register and checking notifications that may have come in overnight at the start of the day, through to ensuring all of your invoices are closed and performing a cash up at the end of the day and then all of the key things in between. So let's start by looking at the calendar and the various appointment information that you can see at a glance. When you first open Timely, it will open up on your calendar. You can view your calendar in different ways, with the most common showing all rostered staff in a day view. But let's take a quick look at some of the viewing options across the top. In the far left-hand corner, you will see a location drop-down. So this will only appear for multi-location businesses in order to switch calendars. So if you are only a single location, this won't appear. Now moving across, we have a staff drop-down, which allows you to view the calendar by staff and resource if you have them set up. Resources in Timely refer to rooms or pieces of equipment that you need to assign to services. So when you select the drop down, you also have a number of viewing options, including all rostered staff, all staff, or individual staff, and also groups of resources. So if we then jump over to the far right hand side, you will see an option for a day, week, and month. Whilst the most common is to view all rostered staff by day, you might be looking for the next available appointment for a specific staff member. So selecting that staff member, and then viewing by week or month might be a better option. The date bar in the middle gives you a few options to quickly and easily navigate from day to day. Today obviously will bring you always back to today. The large date bar will allow you to select a specific date from the calendar drop down and the single arrows on the outside will move you a single day back and forth and finally those double arrows will generate a drop down and that allows you to jump a selected number of weeks back or forth so you don't need to manually count them. This feature is particularly helpful when you're rebooking your client in for their next appointment. Now, most people do view their calendar by all roster staff in a day view, so we're going to work with that today. But first, let's open the register. Now, Timely's cash management feature lets you keep track of all of your sales and petty cash expenses through the register. Then, when it comes to the end of the working day, you simply perform a cash up to make sure that everything adds up. Before you can raise any sales, you will need to open the register. Click on the location name and choose Open Register. This is essentially a virtual opening of the day's sales and everything in between opening and closing the register will be recorded as that day's cash up. You open and close the register over here in the top right corner. This is also where you can switch users, change locations if you do have multiple locations and also log out. When you click open register, a box will pop up asking you to enter the float amount and then just click open and now you'll be able to put through transactions for the day. If you forget to open the register first thing, please don't panic as Timely will actually prompt you when you do try to process your first transaction and you won't be able to put this through until it's open. Any sales raised now will be assigned to the selected register, but you can easily switch between registers at any time. Click on the register and select choose register from the options. In the pop-up window, select the register you'd like to use instead and click switch to confirm the change. Next, we're going to take a look at messages and notifications. First thing in the morning after opening the till, it's really good to check any SMS messages that have come in overnight. Now it's important to note SMS messages are not filtered by location. So you need to be really careful when viewing the SMS messages that you are only replying to or marking red the ones for your location. These can be checked up here in the messages section under SMS replies. 
This gives you a nice simple place to view and reply to all of your messages. Now you can clearly see who the messages are from. If they relate to a booking, you can also click through to the booking, view the message in full, plus send a reply. It's a good idea to mark messages as read so the notification goes away. If an automatic action has occurred, then there is nothing you need to do and these can just be marked as read. To mark a message as read, just select the message and you have the option to mark it or delete it at the top. Any unread messages in the inbox will show as a red number at the top of the messages tab here. As a general rule, we don't recommend deleting messages from here as this will actually remove from the record of the customer's profile as well. If you have online bookings set up and have your appointments set to be confirmed manually, it's a really good idea to check these first thing in the morning as well. So if you jump over here to the dashboard under the activity tab, you will have a column called pending. This will show any unconfirmed online bookings and you can go through them and confirm them manually directly from this screen or click on them to show you more details about the client or the booking. If your online bookings are actually also set to automatically confirm, then you won't need to do this step. So we have now covered how to start your day in Timely. Let's take a short break and I'll be back shortly to go over the calendar and customer profiles with you. <music>